olives. Uh -huh. Olives are a great source of flavor in the Italian cuisine. Now, all of Italy, the whole peninsula grows olives. Uh, Italy has uh, 20 regions. Every region, I think, with the exception of one or two, make olive oil and have olives. And therefore, cured olives are very much used in cooking mm -hmm. all over Italy. Uh, this is from Le Marche, uh, a, a small region on the Adriatic. You know, Italy is you know, the boot, right. and then it has across the north the Alps, which yeah. is the chain of the mountains, and then down the peninsula uh, is the Apennines. So it's like the backbones of Italy. So Italy, and it's small because all of Italy is the size maybe of California, uh, in a region like Le Marche, you got the mountain food, and then it comes down into the ocean, and you got the, the ocean food. And within this context, there's a lot of microclimates, mm. and that's why a lot of products, beautiful products, flavorful products, uh, olives need a moderate, uh, mild climate, mm -hmm. uh, and they like to see the ocean in a distance, but not be near the ocean so much, uh, and they get all those, those flavors. So, Olives, there's more than about, I don't know, 1,400 different wow. types of olives. Uh, this one, I think, is a pecholine, and we'll talk about pecholine. This is what you found, and it's a great mm -hmm. one. Okay. Here you have a, a nice selection of different olives. You know, you have the pecholines. Uh, you have, let me just put it down, because I want to show you also, you know, um, the thrill, I guess, of, of cooking and sharing, and, and you've been connecting with viewers forever is to deliver them information, to bring something to them that they can take and make their own. Right. right. Uh, so then we're gonna go through that okay. as much as we can here. Well, no, I love it because when you go into Central Market, there are so many different olives to choose from and it helps to know what flavors you're going to get out of what ones. And I love knowing where they come from. And now we'll have a story of Lydia's <laughs> behind these olives so it'll make it even more fun. Okay, so here you have uh, olives. Now olives are always green. Uh -huh. When they mature, they become black. So it's not that you have a black olive or a green olive. It's, oh, yeah, they okay. become green, then they become speckled, and then they become all black, and that's what you have. So you have more mature olives here than this. This is a pecholine, this is a gaeta, this is um, cerignola, the big cerignola mm -hmm. uh, varietal. And this is, it looks like it's a mature uh, cerignola, this one, that, and then cured in brine. What I recommend is that you always get an olive with a pit, and then you remove really? the peat. Yeah, because you know once the the olive is open and you mm -hmm. have it soaking in in brine uh, or whatever, the flavors come out. Right. And they right. go into that liquid. This this is a, a tough olive to 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 pit, but if you cut it like this, you get all of the the meat a, and the meat, <laughs> and you use that. Especially if you're doing pasta or something, this is. This is great. Let's not waste anything. Let's put it in here. Uh, let's take the picholine. If it's a smaller olive, mm -hmm. you, you, you have the olive. Sort of make it from on a wooden board or whatever. With the knife, you just press it, and it cracks, ah. and you just get the pit right out like that. A lot easier than it sounds, yeah. OK, and gotcha. you use it like that. And you have all of the flavors. You retain all of the flavors in there. Wonderful. And now, the fact that these are the same varietal, this one being more mature, the flavors change? Is it like going from a grape to a raisin kind of thing? Uh, it, it is to some extent because, yeah. you know, maturation is, is about, you know, uh, the, the, the water that's in the fruit eventually mm -hmm. coming its peak and the kind of bursting, the flavor bursting out. And to some extent, dehydrating and, and concentrating those, those flavors. Interesting. Okay.